Hoping they get the pick six up at nearly 340,000 rand. And they're racing away from that 1,600 metre position to a fair enough start for them. Hamlet was the first to respond. So Datcha has burst through to lead them early on with hot ice along the inside. Mohandas is also right up there, just two lengths off the leader with Law Court on the far side. Hamlet racing further back now. Then came Shambok, and behind that one was the driven along Great Ecstasy on the outside of Military Man. They halfway down the field. Then came Jack Ryan, who's uh, well back in the field, about eight to nine lengths off the leader. They followed by this time round, who races behind that. Green Falcon is racing towards the rear with twice a saint, and they're about ten lengths off the leader. As they go away towards the 1,000-metre marker and up in front, here is So Datcha, led it by just over a length from Mahanderson second. Law Court races up on the outside third. Hot Ice is rousted along in fourth position with Hamlet further back in the field. Then came Military Man, and along the inside of those is uh, Jack Ryan, who races about six lengths off the leader together with Shambok. Two lengths away to this time round. Military Man has lost position now, racing towards the rear. Green Falcon is behind those and at the back end of the field is Wolfram as they turn for home now Law Court gets sent about its business early it's Law Court in the home straight down the inside Green Falcon runs a big race on the outside is Great Ecstasy then came Mohanda so Tetra behind those and then Jack Ryan it's Law Court and Green Falcon is finishing fast Law Court Green Falcon down the inside and it's down the inside Green Falcon that picked it up and Green Falcon goes on to win it from in second Law Court third place will go to Shambok, and it's going to get tight for that uh, fourth position there and we'll pick that up one in the slow-mo and uh, towards the rear military man as we'll pick up the head-on replay law court comes to the front hits the front with authority but green falcon is produced by samunga kamala at exactly the right time to collar law court close to the line and it's going to go to number three green falcon the opening leg of the pick six winner here Well, the Falcon lands. Green Falcon finds the winner's box here in the Eastern Cape. And uh, definitely a horse that you would have had in your perms, having had the two runs so far for the two placings. And uh, Joseph joins me. Joseph has got a lot to celebrate with the 1,500 Rand World Sports betting check. Joseph, enjoy it. Yes. Certainly well-deserved. Green Falcon looked the part this afternoon. Smunga got to steer him to victory. And it came down to having to catch the pace. Were you always confident you were going to get there? Yes, uh, Nadine, obviously, uh, the last couple of uh, uh, races I rode with him, uh, he, he sort of like looks to run um, around and, uh, you know, just <laughs> always makes the jockey's life hard when they do that. But uh, this time around, uh, Mr. Smith asked me what you want to do. I felt uh, giving him a chance and having horses in front that he can go and fetch. I think yes. it would be ideal instead of us being right there and waiting for them. So I think today... Uh, we came out, the pace was on, and uh, I yeah, was at the back there collecting Smiling. the poly. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't smile, though. But uh, we just took it uh, step by step. The guys obviously are on the bend. You can see they started to have uh, uh, horses to tire, and uh, I weaved my way through it, came top of the straight uh, angle for the inside. He saw the, the horse in front, and he went for it. And as oh. soon as he got there, too, he started... He was already <laughs> putting on brakes, yeah. <laughs> already putting on brakes. I was like, oh, no, come on. And I asked him for that effort, and he, he he just dug down deep. He won quite a nice race. Big thanks uh, to Smith Racing Team. Uh, big thanks uh, to uh, obviously the connection. Denver, <laughs> at last you got this one. So big well done to Denver. And, uh, you know, obviously we, we try our best at all times uh, to just, uh, you know, uh, get the horses from yes. wherever we can and uh, bring them here, still have racing here, um, uh, uh, enjoy. And, uh, you know, as long as the owners are there to support, uh, We'll always uh, try our best to make everybody happy. And uh, again, uh, you know, I think today's an, quite a nice, special day for Mr. Smith. Obviously, the, uh, the, the team at one. home, uh, Peak 100, it's yep. always a, a very nice one. So uh, big thanks uh, um, to him for having me around just to 
uh, he helped me to win my first championship and my second championship. Oh, so so special, yeah. it is quite special. And, uh, you know, uh, we would never be here if it wasn't for him. So big thanks uh, for always believing and uh, just being there as a... Sometimes, you know, as a rider, things don't go your way. Yeah. And he comes back, he brush it off your shoulder. And I says, I just go ahead and uh, look for another race, yeah. you know. So that's always nice. Uh, you don't uh, have to always think about that one race. Always uh, look forward to the next one. And I think uh, uh, that really helps us to focus more on what's coming. So, yeah, to Dean uh, and everyone, obviously, that does the hard work behind the scenes, getting all the owners, big well done. And uh, again, to the Smith Racing team, there you go. Great, great, put, uh, great way of putting it from Smunga. There's some lovely words from him. It's lovely to have these ra racing relationships that go back and you have these special moments together. And Gav, with that, very well done for the 100th win. I know racing is all about putting your head down, trying to do that a little bit more, trying to get better. But you've got to take a little bit of time to celebrate these moments. No, thank you very much for the kind words. And yeah, you won't be able to achieve these things without the team behind you. Um, there's a lot of people behind the scenes that I've got to thank and uh, my beautiful wife behind me 110% of the way to my son Dino, the passion is there, he's behind me 120% of the way and <laughs> it's, uh, it's lovely, it's a big team effort to Francie, to Andrew, yeah. to the grooms, to Victor, Jared, uh, all my guys, to Bondas, uh, you know, to, to, to have 100 winners is no mean feat in any mm -hmm. centre and every season it's something we always try and strive to do. So to get there is, is, is an achievement in its own and I'm just very grateful and very blessed. And um, yeah, to everybody, to all the grooms at home, everybody does the work, um, they will get rewarded. So yeah, it's just nice and it's lovely to have a winner for Denver. It's his first winner for us and uh, he wants me to dedicate this to his sons, Deandre, and to Dante. Just well done to them. To Denver and his wife, well done guys, and lovely to have him in the yard. Um, he's passionate about his mm. racing. And we worked this guy out, Nate. Um, you know, last time we thought 400 out, we were a winner, 300 out, we were a winner. But Samanga got off and gave us the feedback we needed to work with. Said, you can't get to too early on him. He wants to get out of it. He went left and right. And, yeah, yeah. and you know, you've ridden. And he was just trying to, he was holding back. And the horse put it's running away on the outside. And he didn't see him and went on and won his race, you know. So today we took our chances in the poly track. It's not optimum to drop them in that no, far. No, it's not. <laughs> um, but we took our chances. We, you know, give him a chance and let him run on. And uh, a superb ride, you know, to get from where he was to get a run, to get a split and to go and on to win the race. Uh, he's got more to come. He, he's yeah. just holding back. And I think as he matures, he'll be a fun horse. He's a good, clean sound just horse. Hopefully now he's got his nose in front. It's a confidence booster for him. 100%, mm. mates, you know, and I, I think he's good. just easy enjoying himself mm. down here. So just very well done to Denver. Well, very, very well done to Denver for being part of the Race Horse Owners Association because because of that, he's scooping that extra 15,000 Rand check. So there's a lot for Denver to smile about today. 100%, mates, thank you. Gav, before you run away, competitive card going through. Just going to single out a couple but please let me know if I've left any out. I just think Captain Marisco ran one such a good race last time. He meets similar again here. And track commander, it could be a case of consistency rewarded today. No, I've got to agree with you. I, I think my, my card is very, very tough today. Um, there's nothing I can say. You can, you can just yeah. go out and make a pointer. I think it's a very open card and, and very tough for my yard. But they finely tuned and they look tremendous so they'll be giving of the best I think you've picked out probably two of, of the better ones and and I've got to say as well bold strike if he puts his exactly. mind on it don't also leave him consistent. out you know uh, track command has got a bit of a draw to worry about um, but um, and uh, Captain Marisco won a very good race last time out no, so you, you're so correct with it brilliant Gab well once again huge congratulations uh, I think it's a brilliant feat and well done no, thank you very much and a big thank you to my sponsors Hollywood they've been with me for years lovely to have the guys behind the yeah. scenes and thanks every to everybody brilliant thank you Great achievement there from the Gavin Smith Racing Yard as they round up winner 100 for the season so far in the way of Green Falcon, who's a guy who needed a bit of working out, but they've definitely got uh, the finger on the right button today, and Smunga's got him home in fine style. To Ziandre and Dante, well, this one's dedicated to you from your dad. Denver, well done.